Welcome back to Crypto 101, your comprehensive guide to all things crypto, where we break down the complex world of blockchain technology into bite-sized pieces. Today we're diving straight into decentralized finance, or DeFi for short. Let's go. DeFi Saver is an all-in-one management app for decentralized finance, providing you fully non-custodial access to protocols such as Aave, Compound, Morpho, Maker, and Liquity. More on them later. Imagine a financial system that operates without the need for banks or middlemen. That's decentralized finance, or DeFi for short. But why is it so revolutionary? Firstly, DeFi is trustless. Unlike traditional finance, which relies on trusted intermediaries such as banks, DeFi is automated by smart contracts on a blockchain such as Ethereum. This allows financial transactions to be carried out without the need to trust a central authority. Second, DeFi is permissionless. Anyone with an internet connection can access DeFi protocols and services, regardless of their location or background. All you need is a crypto wallet, which will allow you to store and spend your cryptocurrencies. One popular example of a crypto wallet is MetaMask. Finally, DeFi is decentralized. It's in the name. Instead of being controlled by a single entity, DeFi platforms are distributed across a network of computers, making them resistant to censorship or a single point of failure. Now let's compare DeFi to traditional finance and centralized finance, sometimes called TradFi and CeFi. But first, a quick word from our sponsor. DeFi Saver is an all-in-one management app for decentralized finance that provides access to top lending protocols in the Ethereum ecosystem. With support for protocols such as Aave, Maker, Compound, Spark, Liquity, and Morpho Blue, and features such as one transaction leverage management, collateral and debt swaps, protocol shifts, and various automation features, it aims to make management of your on chain positions much easier. Check it out at defisaver.com. In traditional finance or TradFi, transactions are slow, expensive, and often require intermediaries or middlemen. Banks hold your funds, and you're subject to their rules and regulations. DeFi, on the other hand, offers instant transactions at a fraction of the cost, with no need for intermediaries. Even in crypto, we have forms of centralized finance, or CeFi. A prime example is centralized exchanges, where a centralized entity controls your funds and your data. These centralized crypto banks are vulnerable to hacks and government intervention. In contrast, DeFi puts you in control of your assets and your data through the power of cryptography. This is where the phrase comes from, not your keys, not your crypto. So whether you're tired of waiting days for a bank transfer or concerned about the security and control of your funds, or you're just seeking new opportunities undiluted by middlemen taking their fees, DeFi offers a compelling alternative. So there you have it, the basics of DeFi, what it is, and why it's an improvement over traditional and centralized financial institutions. On that note, please remember none of this is financial advice and is intended solely for informational purposes. Always do your own research, make sure to subscribe for future videos, and stay defiant.